So dropping down into a goddess squat, allow your heels to either float in the air or be flat on the mat. As you stand, open up through the arms, stretch the chest and palm tree. So moving in and out from goddess squat up, allowing yourself to come onto the balls of the feet if you want to work on balance, rotating the arms to stretch the chest. Engaging the inner thighs down in goddess squat. Tucking the tail, using your core muscles to balance as you lift into palm tree. So from palm tree, we move into our lunge flow, dropping down into gecko first. We'll practice this on both sides, lifting up, transitioning to the opposite side. Elbow comes down to the instep for gecko. Coming down, elbow to instep. Next, we move into a twist. Remember to twist from the deep belly muscles, transition around, right elbow to right instep, rotate and twist. Coming back around to the other side, moving through gecko, through your twist, and hand to the left hip crease, straighten both legs, move into our reverse triangle variation, and we lift. Moving into gecko, drop the elbow, twist and revolve triangle variation. Coming back around to the front of the mat, we move through gecko, transition to the twist, revolve triangle, and then a pyramid. Navel moving to the thigh, feel the stretch on the left leg hamstring, back of the thigh, and come up. Slowly transition to the other side. Elbow drops to instep. Move through the twist. Come back through revolve triangle. And just rotate torso to thigh. Narrow the stance if necessary. Hamstring stretch. Transitioning now back to the front of the mat. We'll lower ourselves down onto the mat. Preparing for a superman stretch. Strengthening the low back. Extend the arms, palms facing, lengthen through the legs, thumbs point to the sky. And as we lift, we bend and reach. Feel the stretch moving through the front of the body. Tone and strengthen the back of the upper shoulders as you lift. So we're moving the arms slowly through a range of motion. At the top, we open the chest. Reaching lifting and transitioning now into bow pose, holding on to the tops of the feet or the ankles. Knees should be about hips width apart. Press the feet into the hands to lift the upper body. Feel the stretch in the chest. So draw the navel up a little bit as you tuck the tail to protect your back in bow. And as we lower, allow your body to lengthen out and we'll Move into child's pose to counter our bow, reaching out through the arms. Allow your thumbs to point to the ceiling, lengthening through the back, through the side waist, using your breath, stretching. <laughs> 